don't stand up, so get ready, okay? <laughs> what does AW stand for? After Wednesday. <laughs> Why is after Wednesday significant? Uh, oh, it's just, uh, the same part. It's part two. Oh, yeah, because okay. then we have uh, we're done with weddings for two weeks. And how many did we just do? Four in six, six days. Four in six. Four. Well, four in six. Four in six. Days. We've done six in a couple weeks, but four in six days. Okay. What is the big complex by Camp Garcia? And why isn't it being used? Um, does this place was supposed to be part of the Olympics that was first we have Puerto Rico, but when they decided to not do it, they decided to stop the project. It was supposed to have an auditorium, um, basketball com complex, and all that kind of stuff. It was going to be a training facility for the Summer Olympics okay. for the big Olympics being held on the main island. Okay. And why does it look like it looks right now? What? Why does it look the way it looks now? Why haven't they done anything with it? Because now this area is part of the bio bay um, and people are more careful about that area. Right, it was built too close to, too the, bio close bay to the bio bay to do a big play. lit events at night. Okay. It's part of University of Puerto Rico now and we're all curious as to what they'll do with it someday. All right, Janice gets point. What is going on with our bio bay and what is the status? Okay. That's ours. That's all I'll give it to you. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, but you didn't wait till the end of the question. I'm still uh, going to let you have it. Okay, did you realize okay. it and put it back down, which didn't give you time to get it back up? Okay. Okay, go ahead. Okay, uh, the bio bay is going to our renovating process. In the past year, uh, it wasn't shiny the way it used to be. So Only for the past couple of months. Only for a couple of, so now they are rejuvenating and going back. Called. And everybody says it's sparkly and perfect. It's sparkly and Okay, yay! Okay, another point for Janice. Now, why are there mongooses on Vieques? Why is this significant? And you get an extra point if you know the story about Culebra. How does Vieques get its power and water? You'll never answer this because your hand came up before the question. <laughs> um, isn't there like an underground tunnel that from like the big island that comes here? All right, such a bad answer. We're gonna let Janice okay. try and give us a better <laughs> answer for this. Um, we get our power and water for the big island, so it's like a it's kind of a tunnel actually. That, so when they get out of power, we as well get like out of power. Okay, oh, yeah, nobody gets a point for this one. <laughs> uh, can you name at least two good snorkeling spots? Um, Media Luna y Mosquito Beach. And there's another one. Oh, All right. Do we remember the other one? I read Mosquito Pier in Green Beach. Okay. She's right. Explain the horse situation on Vieques. Go for it. I just know that they came over from Spain and then, I don't know his name, but some man bought, like, brought 50 horses here. Okay, but what's our current situation with the horses? They run everywhere. Yes! <laughs> they do, and are they owned or are they wild? Depends. Some are owned and some most are owned. owned. Most are owned, and they just don't keep con keep them contained. Um, we'll give you a half point for that one. Okay. Um, unless you have one more thing to add that might clarify it better, because I've talked extensively about what they tried to do about the horses. Isn't thing. it if like a horse they kind of run like roam around, and the horse damages something? No one owns it, but if you take the horse then someone will come get it and be like, that's my horse. Oh, yeah, you did read the book. Okay. <laughs> we'll give you a whole point for that, which means we need a tiebreaker question. Without turning around, without looking at anything, what are the last names of our next bride and groom to get married on Vieques? Fonte Ramos. Fonte Ramos. Oh. What are their first names? 
um, Nicole Kwan and Chris Adams. Okay. You're ready. <laughs> Janice.